It's a rare event, a total solar eclipse, and millions of Americans are expected to travel to see the awe-inspiring sight on April 8th. But that means more drivers on the roads and more passengers at airports. You really need to plan ahead and be safe. Communities from Mexico up to Canada are in the path of totality, meaning the moon will completely cover the sun, creating total darkness during daylight. Some areas like Western New York are expecting a million visitors. Elizabeth Carey with AAA has several tips for drivers, like navigating the old fashioned way with a map, especially if you're traveling in less populated areas. In a very rural area, you're talking about wilderness with no cell service. AAA also recommends drivers don't try and watch the eclipse while driving. Have your headlights on. Don't wear your eclipse glasses while driving and watch out for animals. It could trigger wildlife to be out and about. And if you're flying, the FAA is warning travelers to expect long lines and possible delays at airports. Monday's eclipse falls during the busy spring break travel season. The FAA says they're expecting more than 46,000 flights the day after the eclipse. For Consumer Watch, I'm Jen Sullivan.